All right, hey Aries. So you guys, I am doing the ghosted set. <clears throat> And if um, this one doesn't resonate, make sure you check your rising moon and Venus signs. And if the, those don't resonate, check the um, the previous reads or just uh, make sure you subscribe because I do the ghosted sets every week. All right, so I'm gonna get um, the recent past with you and your person. So for Aries, the recent past. For Aries. All right. Okay, so. There's a lot of negative um vibes i'm getting for whoever i'm talking to i'm not not from you um i i meditate on you as the um the zodiac but your person's energy um for the intention of the read all right so the recent past um i feel like this person um they really hurt you um it's like they they did they did take your heart um so i don't feel like this was something that um I don't feel like it was something that was just a wham bam thing. I I feel like this was um I feel like you guys um have had known each other for some time, a couple months, maybe longer. Um with the 9 of swords, that's that's stress, worry, anxiety. Um and then the 7 of swords is the cheating, lies, manipulation. Um so I almost feel like somebody was just kind of holding on to your energy. And using it at their disposal and with the ten of wands um, I feel like this is you more so your energy just trying to hold on to the situation so let me just see what this person that you're dealing with I, I'm actually gonna check their energy what is this person's energy the one that's dealing with um, Aries their energy Okay, so their energy is, they got the Sun card, the Wheel of Fortune, and the Empress card coming out. Okay, um, so what I feel is they could have already had somebody um, in their energy, and I don't know if you know about this person or not, but with the Empress card coming out, um, I do feel like they, this person just kind of up and left you. Um, with the Wheel of Fortune, it's, it's, some, it's something um, sudden. Um, usually it's a good thing and in this person's mindset um, I, I feel like that's what they're they're saying and I don't know if this person they had this person or if they left this person um, for you but let me just see what their current situation is um, it could be their energy I, I almost feel like this person's um, got some narcissistic uh, tendencies for some reason like uh, this person is the kind of person that um man they think about themselves all right so their energy is um i feel like it's all about seeking their happiness um, which is fine because that's what we should all be doing but not at the expense of just up and leaving somebody so their current situation is here's what i feel um this okay so Here's what I feel. I, I, I'm, I'm taking it. I'm kind of retracting. I don't feel like this person has a person, but I, I almost feel like they, um, they're not going to stop until they find their, their happiness, almost as if nothing is good enough for this person. And their situation is, um, essentially what they're doing is they're blocking, um, any sort of real love from coming in. So their love life is actually, uh, I feel moving along very, very slowly, um, and I, I just got to tell you, I don't feel like you're the first person that they've done this to. All right. Um, let's just see um, why they ghosted you. Why did this person ghost Aries? All right. So here's what I feel. Um, I, I'm being led to tell you that it's it's not that this person has somebody in their energy, but I feel like this person has probably had one 
true form of love, all right, that actually ended up hurting them. Okay, so this person, that's why it takes, that's why it's taking so long. Um, I almost feel like this person may have actually been ghosted or this situation happened to them. And um, they're, I almost feel like they're so ego or 3D that um, they are deciding to take that out on other people who don't deserve it. Okay, um, I feel like, I don't feel like there's an, I feel like the Eight of Swords, if you just kind of look at the energy, I feel like they, they've, they've been done wrong by somebody in their past and that's why they're not giving themselves to anybody and with the hangman you know that's a period of uh, not communi not communicating and i almost feel like that's what they choose to do um try, almost trying to find like with that empress energy that came out i almost try to i almost feel like they're trying to find this person um that made them feel um really really extremely happy uh, but then this person, I, I, the Empress energy that's they're looking for, I feel like ended up doing them dirty. All right. So how do they feel about Aries? How does this person feel about Aries? All right. So... Okay, so here's what I feel. Um, if I do feel like this person may have jammed on it um, at the, the the signs where you maybe started hinting that you wanted something more from this person. Okay, I feel like this person knows better than to do what they did. All right, and they probably have even thought about coming back around to you. How do they feel? Um, I feel like this card, the Ace of Pentacles, is a representation of you maybe um, saying, "Hey, hey, hey, can we move forward? All right, let's let's make something work." Um, the Magician card is somebody who gets stuff done. They don't wait around and sit around for it to happen. And I almost feel like this person is looking at you as somebody who was like, "I can't do the situation that we're in. Um, are we going to move forward or?" Do I need to pull my energy away? And I almost feel like you were surprised um, by this person's response to your honesty. So, um, what is their intentions um, towards Aries now? What is their intentions? All right. Okay. So, all right. I here's what I feel is after um, a period of time, all right, this person is going to have this revelation about how they have been doing things. Okay, and I'm just going to tell you um, what does go around, um, what goes around comes around. All right, and with this Ten of Pentacles, um, this is a form of wish fulfillment. And I almost feel like this you're seeing this right here happen before this person actually sees it happen. They're going to have to go through um, a little awakening. All right, but I feel like now at this point, you know more about what's going to happen here than this person does. Um, so is this person, um, do they plan on coming back? Do they plan on coming back? Okay, so <laughs> look at that. All right, so there's going to be a little um, closing out of the current cycle, which is where you've ghosted. Um, I feel like that's what's ending is you um, and the unknown when it comes to this person. All right, but I, I do feel that they're coming back. All right, um, to offer, um, extend an apology, extend some messages. Um, the Seven of Pentacles talks about healing. Um, it's it's a healing so i do feel like this person's going to come back and try to heal um even if it's you guys not getting back together um you're going to know how, how to respond to this when it happens so i'm just going to see what the advice is for you at this point what's the advice okay <laughs> okay here's the advice look at um i don't know what made me look under here but i just gotta tell you if you guys um had started something based off of sex don't give it up to this person okay uh you need to make sure and i almost feel like it, it's it's 
y'all, I feel like you guys are going to get comfortable enough to each other to where you start talking um, that might lead to um, um, sexting or um, talking and sexual content. <sighs> With the King of Pentacles coming out, you just need to stay in this energy. And I know that you're not an earth sign, all right? But you stay in this in this mode. Like, I'm, I'm actually way better than what you treated me, and I'm not going to take anything less. That's why I'm telling you not to give it up. Whether you are a man or a woman, do not, okay? There's going to be um, a rebirth of the situation, but for those of you who want this person back, you need to make sure that the situation has actually healed from when this person ghosted you to begin with, all right? And then for others of you, it is um, a healing process that's going to take place. This person is going to come back anyway, probably try to get in your good graces, but by the time they do, you're already, um, you're already changing a cycle and embodying this. Uh, people aren't going to treat me like shit energy anymore. Okay, so I'm going to roll this dice and the intention um, is between days and weeks. All right. And um, the um, the the um, the quicker the progress you want to make in the situation um, is dependent upon your vibration. So nobody likes to be vibing low. All right. So do what you can to um, embody self-love and don't be stuck in why me, what happened, da, 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 da. Um, just get away from the low vibration um, thought processes and thinking. So I'm going to roll this dice now to see what the time frame is. All right. So we have uh, between 11 days and 11 weeks. All right. Um, and that is from between now and 11 days, between now and 11 weeks. But it's between that time frame. Okay. And then we have eight days, eight weeks. And look at that, a couple of days from now or a couple of weeks. And let me just pull some initials to see who we're talking to. And this is going to be yours or their first, middle, or last. Seven, eight. Okay. Um, anything that pertains to you guys, all right? It doesn't have to just be your name. So we have I, Y, R, P, D, B, N, and T. All right, Aries, I'm going to leave it right there for you guys. I hope you let me know who this is resonating with. Please remember, you guys, to keep your positive, uh, your comments positive. Um, I am just going to start deleting the negative because I don't want people to um, um, pick up lower frequencies, including yourself. Um, but if you need to um, be upset or or whatever, you can always email me and I'll take the brunt of it so that um, our viewers and other people who are coming for positive notes um, don't pick up that energy. All right. I love you guys so much, Aries. Thank you guys.